Today um, we had several cows coming in for elective C-section. So this is a little different than a C-section performed on a, on a cow that's having a problem giving birth. So these cows are not actually giving birth at the time. Um, but we know that these cows are ready. So these, these cows have been induced. And so these cows we know are ready. Um, and these cows, the, the, the reason for the C-section in these calves is because they're, um, they're basically an assisted reproductive technique. So they're actually, um, these cows are pregnant by um, IVF type method. Um, and the, the calves are actually much larger um, than the cows can probably have a good chance to deliver on their own. Um, so we do six section on them because they are quite valuable, uh, valuable cows and also very valuable calves. Um, and so we kind of avoid having problems with the, with the delivery process. And um, the, the, the thing that we deal a lot with in, car in calves is this uh, fetal maternal mismatch. And so the, the fetus is much bigger than what the cow's pelvis allows for the calf to come out. Um, and so it's a, because it's an elective procedure, it's fairly straightforward. So it starts in monitoring them for their own, you know, if they're breathing on their own, we monitor their heart rates when they come out, um, and any activity that they show us that in indicates that they're, you know, they're doing well. Um, so within, you know, within the first couple of minutes of being born, um, the calves should be moving, they should be breathing, you know, their breathing rate will be pretty quick initially, but it should be a nice steady rate, um, have a, 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 you know, a, a good heart rate and also showing a lot of movement and so they should also develop a supple reflex within the first you know, one to two minutes um, and be able to hold their head up, shake their head and then also you will hear them vocalising quite a lot. And that's a good sign to us that the, the calf is, you know, is definitely ready for birth um, and is doing well so we don't require, uh, to, we're not required to do any, anything else to help them along.